one of the top things on the GOP agenda is to repeal uh, the president's health care reform legislation. How do you feel about that? Is that the right thing to do right away? I think when we look at health care, uh, I think if we look back and talking to the constituents back in, in my district, and the one thing I can tell you is uh, we missed a golden opportunity. We missed a golden opportunity to have some real reform with regard to health care. And I think that one of the things that I'm concerned about is when we look at the big pieces of legislation that have affected our nation over the past several decades, they've been with broad bipartisan support. We didn't have that here. What this law does is it addresses access to insurance. It does not address cost or quality, which is what the American public have been crying out for. We need to have health care reform. And I, I welcome the opportunity uh, to reach across the aisle to come up with some real solutions. But what we've got right now is wildly problematic. As a small business owner, I can tell you uh, this is creating more uncertainty out there, and the outcomes of this health care law are creating uncertainty for small businesses, medium-sized businesses, which will have a devastating impact on our economy. Congresswoman Sewell, I, something tells me you beg to differ. I do beg to differ, uh, respectfully. <laughs> I appreciate that, <laughs> I oh, You all are so nice. <laughs> Is this going to last? <laughs> but I, I really believe that um, at the end of the day, um, the health care reform uh, will actually save us money, will actually um, provide more people on uh, to the rolls and have better access. I think about my district. It is the poorest district in the state of Alabama the poorest district in the state of Alabama, one of the poorest districts in the nation. And, you know, I get calls from local business leaders and small business owners, and they're grateful to have the opportunity to free up some of that capital to start hiring more people because of the health care reform. And I can tell you that we benefited, you know, greatly day one in my district. And so I think the American people want us to focus on them. And I think that the health care reform uh, what the bill that was passed was actually something that uh, will, in fact, um, you know, produce great benefit. On the other hand, I read that you said you, quote, look forward to tinkering with some of the provisions. So you don't like it all. Well, no, I, I, I think that at the end of the day, um, the bulk, the majority of the provisions in the health care and the actual goal of the health care reform was, uh, was, an, was one that we met, which is to increase the number of people who have access to quality health care. Um, you know, are there, was it a perfect bill? No, it was not a perfect bill. Um, but it was a very good start. And I think that uh, the American people want us to um, keep them in mind and to focus on, um, uh, on getting it right. And I think that, you know, that's something we can do together.